Welcome to Tamish Max. It is exercise 2.2 polynomials and uh, we will do these questions. Once we do questions from our book, no, our confidence level will go more. Find the quadratic polynomial, each with the given numbers as the sum and product of its zero. This 1 by 4 is the sum of the zeros and minus 1 is the product of the zeros. This root 2 is the sum and 1 by 3 is the product like that. We will start. Let the quadratic polynomial be ax square plus bx plus c. Alpha plus beta for case 1 and doing is 1 by 4. Alpha beta is minus 1 which could be written as minus 4 by 4. Why I am doing this means I want this. Alpha plus beta is minus b by a. Alpha beta is c by a. Now comparing, this is a, this is a. So can you tell me what is a? a is 4. Minus b is 1, b is minus 1. And c is minus 4. So what's the quadratic for the first one? ax square plus bx plus c is equal to ax square plus bx plus c. That will be the quadratic polynomial. That will be the quadratic polynomial. Next. The sum is root 2 and the product is 1 by 3. Let ax square plus bx plus c be the quadratic polynomial we want. Now let the zeros of this be alpha beta. Alpha plus beta is root 2. Alpha beta is 1 by 3. Alpha plus beta is 3 root 2 by 3. Alpha beta is 1 by 3. Minus b by a is 3 root 2 by 3. c by a is 1 by 3. What is a? To bring this only I multiply. a is 3. b is minus 3 root 2 and c is 1. So what will be the equation we want? ax square plus bx Plus C. This will be the uh, polynomial we want. This will be the polynomial expression we want. Okay. 3. This is 0 by 1. 0 by 1 is 0 only. So what is A? Comparing A is 1. What is B? B is 0. And what is C? C is root 5. So AX square plus 0 into X plus C. So this will be the polynomial we want for problem 3. Okay? Easy? You understand well? Next one. 1 product of the root is 1. Alpha plus beta is 1. Alpha beta is also 1. What is alpha plus beta? Minus b by a is 1. Which you write as 1 by 1. Alpha beta is c by a. That is 1. Which you write as 1 by 1. So what is a here? a is 1. What is b here? b is minus 1. 
and what is c here c is 1 so what's the equation we want ax square plus bx plus c so this will be the polynomial we want the polynomial is x square minus x plus 1 the polynomial expression is x square minus x plus 1 when we equate it to 0 it will be called an equation otherwise it's called an expression a polynomial expression next we go for problem 5 minus 1 by 4 and 1 by 4 Minus 1 by 4 and 1 by 4. Sum of the roots. Alpha, beta. Alpha plus beta is minus b by a. Alpha, beta, c by a. From this and this, what is a? a is 4. What is B? B is 1. What is C? C is 1. So what will be the equation? 4x squared plus x plus 1. Okay. This is problem number 5. Subdivision 5. Subdivision 6 we go. Subdivision 6. 4 and 1. Alpha, let ax square plus bx plus c be the polynomial we want. Alpha plus beta is 4. And alpha beta is 1. This is minus b by a. And this is c by a. So alpha beta, alpha plus beta minus b by a. Alpha beta is 1, you can write this 1 by 1. 1 by 1 is c by a. Why are we doing this? 4, we can write this 4 by 1. So what is a, anybody? a, anybody? a, a is 1. b is minus 4. And c is 1. So what we are equation? x square minus 4x plus 1. This will be the equation. I hope I'm clear. Now, this exercise 2.2. First subdivision I worked. Second subdivision also I have worked. Now, I'll ask you a few questions. A few questions. If I have I have like this. If alpha and beta are zeros of this, can anybody tell me what will be alpha plus beta? If alpha and beta are zeros of this, can anybody tell me alpha beta? Alpha plus beta will be minus b by a and alpha beta will be c by a. I just gave this for an example. So today in this video, we have done 2.2, the next subdivisions. So we will go about with more videos regarding polynomials. Till then, practice all this and come well prepared to the class. The mandra for success is doing daily lessons.